Joe Biden, he never fell asleep in this interview. But this video, it makes it appear that he did fall asleep and it went viral during the US elections. Videos like this, they're called deep fake videos. They often change the audio or visuals to make it appear that something is happening that it's not. And you can see how it could gain traction, many people sharing something that's simply not true. Deep fake technology has been a concern for disinformation experts for a considerable amount of time. And one of the big questions is how to deal with technology technology like this in an era where misinformation and disinformation can spread so fast. Well, Greg wanted to find an answer to this. Greg took part in one of Ireland's uh, biggest science competitions, the BT Young Scientist and Technology Award, and he won for his project titled uh, Toward Deep Fake Detection. Deep fakes are generated using AI, so it was uh, interesting to see that deep fakes can also be detected using AI. And so my project uses artificial intelligence uh, to detect deep fakes, which is a, a thing that is done currently, but mine does it 10 times faster. So when it comes to your project, you won one of the biggest science competitions in Ireland. What's next and what do you hope happens when it comes to deep fake technology and countering it? Well, I look forward to representing my country in uh, EU CYS in September uh, with the same project or an improved version of this project. And I'm also looking forward to uh, commercializing or productizing this uh, development. Well, good luck in the next part of the competition. Uh, Greg Tarr, who won the Irish version of the BT Young Scientist for his project titled Detecting Towards Deep Fake Detection, taking a look at all this manipulated media and how dangerous it can really be.